done. So this is uh, these are this is all the preparation you need for that sugbakilo dish I told you, right? You've got the uh, the I got jalapeno peppers and that's um, some habanero to kick up the spice a little bit. Um, onions, julienne, ginger, and I've got um, lemon uh, lime for garnishing. And then, can you get me a lemon? I'm gonna, I'm gonna need, I've got uh, about a pound and a half of sushi grade tuna that I got from Time Leaf at uh, $6.99 a pound, uh, which is a lot cheaper than what we got for, I need two lemons. Well, we just said a lemon. Yeah, so I'm gonna use two lemons for a pound and a half of um, the tuna. I've got some pork belly here that I got from Seafood City. And then the uh, the vinegar, I'm gonna try a couple of these vinegars, but um, I use either, if you don't have the coconut vinegar, um, this is the, the name that we have for the coconut vinegar, that's the, the tuba vinegar which is coconut vinegar um, uh, you can also get some of this kind of any kind of Asian store I guess I got this from a Filipino store but you can also use apple cider vinegar vinegar because it's not that uh, acidic it's a milder vinegar and we're really just gonna use it to do an initial wash and then just a little bit on top of the lemon juice to kind of cook the um, the tuna. I'm gonna slice up the tuna. Here, hold it for me. I say, sorry, hold it for me. I'm gonna slice up the tuna, and I've got two mixing bowls over here. Let me show the two mixing bowls over here, just so I can transfer from one side because I'm gonna wash it a few times. I'm gonna wash the fish a few times. I've got two different knives here. I've got the straight edge knife and. This is the one that I'm gonna use. I don't wanna use the serrated knife, although the Cutco has a nice serrated knife because it, it's not really serrated, it's just made differently. But I'm gonna use the straight edge knife because it doesn't tear the, the uh, it makes smoother cuts, basically. So all I do is, I've got like maybe an inch, uh, less than an inch thick. So I really want them to be about uh, just a little bit more than um, half an inch thick. Maybe like, I don't know, five eighths of an inch. And I'm gonna start off with some strips. And then I'll make them into cubes. Uh, cubes about that big not too small not too big either I want to I want them to kind of uh, be thick enough so that it doesn't cook right away in the vinegar you don't you don't want to pickle the su the sushi the the tuna right away the fish meat right away but eventually you want it to also um, be able to soak up the vinegar so it kind of cooks. So, and you can pause right here. I'm going to